And to think there's so much negative in the world, one community puts something on every year that brings out the positive. It's called Positive Addiction, and it originates right here in Lima, Ohio. Local schools participate in a week of fun, a week of knowledge, a week of learning about keeping yourself mentally positive and addicted to the right things in life. Here's the story from May 14, 2010. Lisa Dorfman. I'm from Miami, Florida, and um, I'm the director of sports nutrition and performance for the University of Miami. Lima reminds me of the town I grew up in. It's just really pretty and small town, and everybody's really friendly here. And a couple of people said they wanted to come back to you know with me to Miami, but I, I want to come back to Lima. You know, my message was pretty simple and direct. Uh, I I'm not shy of that way, and and that's uh, three things to eat healthy. Uh, eating healthy gives you strength and energy and endurance and it just makes you feel good about yourself inside and, and out. Uh, number two is to live a clean life, you know, to exercise, to be kind to the people around you. Um, and if you do have some bad thoughts, please go to church and talk about them. And then three is make the Lord number one in your life because I think if we keep it, and that's not simple, that's a huge task but it's an important one for keeping us grounded through all the trials and tribulations and the successes that we have in our lives. You know, getting, getting kids going in the right direction and uh, being involved in, in things that will be positive influences in their lives is, is certainly the way to go. And uh, what better way to do this than have an exciting event like this to, to get them pumped up about something. You know, a lot of positive things that we do, obviously exercise, you know, eating right, you know, uh, reading, um, you know, things that they can do to, you know, avoid um, those temptations with alcohol and drugs and, you know, find some, you know, friends, a group of, a group of friends that they can do things with. Having God in your life is a, is a very positive thing to do. Positive addiction is a way to be with each other and have a good addiction rather than just having all the bad things around you affect you. We do all the fun stuff. We get the volleyball game going, the talent show. We got to set all that stuff up. I actually DJed the dance we had last night, and I was the MC for the talent show. It went fantastic. Positive addiction for me is anything uh, that you can find that, that occupies your time that is not going to produce a negative result. Uh, any type of drugs or alcohol, obviously, you want to stay away from. Anything good would be your hobbies. Uh, anything that you can come up with. Uh, friends that have the same hobbies. Friends that can occupy that time as well. There's no doubt research has demonstrated that the habits that kids have at a young age from five on, really, eating habits, behavioral habits, um, and sometimes, you know, they really use us as, as their role models. So adults, so we need to get our acts together too. You know, this is something positive, something that they're going to, uh, you know, remember, you know, because so, we want to do fine, you know, find ways for kids to, you know, enjoy their lives without all the all the vices and all the, the negative things in our society that's being exposed to. Find friends that are going to have that same impact on you um, that you can have on them and just stay away from the ones that you know that are going to get you into trouble. <laughs>